Okay, another day and another day to solve detective stories for cross logic. Let's see what we will end up with. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Let's solve this one. I think this is the one we're solving for the deadly um, mayor, isn't it? Cases. Oh, it's a different one. Hmm, let's let's try to solve this one then. Deadly hide and seek. The mayor's six-year-old daughter Emily was kidnapped. The perpetrators have not made any demands yet, but time is passing, and hope is almost lost. The police department's best detective logic starts investigation. Where will it lead? Okay. Detective notices a suspicious woman in a maid's uniform, but literally a moment later, she disappears into the crowd of servants. Detective needs to identify her. Mm. Okay. Redhead is a chef. Okay. The maid has dark hair. The dark haired girl is wearing green apron. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Chef. Okay. The blonde girl isn't wearing apron. Isn't wearing a red apron. Uh huh. The isn't wearing a red apron. So that person's wearing light, definitely. Okay, and uh, mm -hmm, interesting. Mm -hmm. The redhead is the chef. <laughs> the maid has dark hair. The dark haired girl is wearing a green apron. The maid has dark hair. Okay. The redhead is the chef. So the blonde girl is wearing a blue apron. The maid is wearing green. The blonde girl is wearing red. I'm missing anything here. The red head is the chef. Okay. The blonde girl. Oh, the blonde girl is the light hair color. Light. And she's wearing blue. There you go. Okay. Mm, complete. Let's do this. Continue. She made sense. It, the, the maid sense that someone was following her, trying to hide in one of the cars. The blues are playing in the sedan. Okay. Country music is not playing in the convertible. The truck is not red. The truck is not red. The blues are playing in the gray car. The blues are playing in the gray car. Okay, the blues are playing in the sedan. So the sedan is a gray car. Mm -hmm. The truck is black and the wraps playing there. Convertible is red. Oops. Mm. 
let's just start. Okay, let's repeat. The blues are playing in the sedan. The blues are playing in the sedan. There you go. The country music is not playing in the convertible. Oh, okay. The truck is not red. Okay. And the blues are playing in the gray car. The blues are playing in the gray car. There you go. So the convertible is definitely red. And the truck is black. Convertible is playing rap music. And truck is playing country. There you go. Next one, please. Technology follows the mid car. She drives very fast and disappears out of sight at the intersection, violating every conceivable traffic law. The only clue that can lead to her whereabouts is a piece of gravel. This is going to be hard. There's no tunnel on the road on the left. There's no tunnel on the road on the left, but a concrete road can be seen. Concrete on the left. The road to the right leads to a tunnel. The road to the bridge is asphalted. Mm -hmm. Road to the bridge is asphalted. Mm -hmm. There is no tunnel on the road on the left. There is no tunnel on the road on the left. But the concrete road can be seen. The road to the right leads to the tunnel. The road to the bridge is asphalted. I hold on. Road to the bridge is asphalted. Okay. So they are missing anything here. Now we have to lock. We have to lock this thing. So the road to the right the road to the left is concrete and highway there you go right and the road to the left is the highway and the road to the right is gravel merit perfect Oof. Detective almost overtakes a suspect, but she managed to enter the large door. The dogs guarding the door apparently do not intend to let the detectives through. But what if you call them by their names written in their kennels? Do you think it will work? The Newfoundland is lying close to the blue door. Okay. Johnny is not sitting at the green door. Johnny is not sitting at the green door. Johnny is not sitting at the green door. Oh, sorry. Nope, no, no. The bull terrier's name is not Derek. And he is not at the red door. The Malinois name, named Harry. can be found lying by the yellow door. The Laika's name is not Derek. The Yaika? Laika. It's not Derek. 
like it's not there okay okay from here we can say that Derek is a Newfoundland and Derek is blue um, Laika is red and Voltaire is green Laika is red and, oh, and Harry is a Malinois and yellow But he's green. Okay, perfect. Detective finally gets inside. The first thing he hears is a baby cry. You need to find the girl in this labyrinth of rooms, blah blah. Her favorite toy, which she always carries around, will serve as clue. There's no doll and no ticking clock in the hall. The teddy bear was left in the living room where the cracklings of logs is also heard. There's no clock in the bathroom or in the room where the detective found the puzzles. The doll is lying in the same room where the water is dripping. Maybe this one also is here in the bathroom. There's no other place where the dripping can happen, right? There's no doll and no taking lock in the hall. Teddy bear was left in the living room where the crackling of logs can be heard. Mm -hmm. What you will find in the hall is nothing yet. There's no clock in the bathroom. Let's assume it's in the bathroom for now. <laughs> What's left here? Dining room. Where's the puzzle? Tiny bear. Crackling of logs. Oh, crying is in the hall. Oh, there's puzzles. Is this correct? It's correct. Awesome. Last one. The detective finds a toy. At the same time, loud voices can be heard nearby. We must hide. But the only suitable place for this is the room with the closed door and the puzzle lock. Okay. The ba the badger does not live next to the oak. The maple does not grow where the heron the heron lives. Okay, the eagle doesn't like oak or maple. The eagle doesn't like oak or maple. The pigeon and the hedgehog live in the spruce forest. The pigeon and the hedgehog. The fox and the nightingale live near the same tree. Fox and the Nightingale. It's in the same tree. Hmm. Interesting. Question is 
where, right? So the badger does not live next to the oak. The maple does not grow where the heron lives. The eagle doesn't like oak or maple. Oh, okay, the nightingale now is with the fox. They live in maple. Awesome. The pigeon and the hedgehog live near the spruce forest. Okay, hedgehog is with the pigeon. Okay, the heron lives in the oak. And the eagle lives in pine. Who are they living with? Um, the fox is with the oak. Here. So we're not left with the wolf and the badger. The badger doesn't live next to the oak. Oof. Oof. Maple doesn't grow where the heron lives. Okay. Fox and oak the pine. The eagle doesn't like pine. The pigeon. And the hedgehog. Fox okay. So we're left with the eagle and heron. doesn't like oak or maple. So maybe the badger lives here? Let's see. Oh, it's the other round. How many oh. times have Okay. We kind they kinda of erased my mistakes, so so it's actually so the fox and the nightingale lives in maple okay and the wolf the badger lives in pine and the badger lives with the eagle and the wolf is here there you go awesome Oh, there's a reward. Mm, interesting. Okay, I think we're done with this one. And uh, another day. Or maybe in a matter of a few hours, I'll try this again. The next uh, game. Thank you.